Good evening, everyone. Christian Arnett here for Card Player TV, and I'm coming to you from the Bellagio. It's the end of day 1A of the $15,000 buy-in World Poker Tour Five Diamond World Poker Classic. There were just over 200 players in the field, including top contenders in the Card Player Player of the Year race. Those players include Elke Graspier, who is currently third, Ivan Demidov, who's fourth, and the current leader, John Fan. We got to catch up with him on a break to talk about his year so far and how the last couple months the cards have been a little cold. It's like a dream come true, you know, playing really good, get really lucky, but lately it hasn't been like that the last two months. It's been so rough. Like really? today, I had pocket king, I lost. Pocket A, I lost. Like all my big pairs losing. So. Among the big name pros who made it through day 1A are Joel Brunson, Eli Elezra, and Phil Helmuth. We got to catch up with Helmuth after play ended. Well, how did you end up on the day? I ended up with uh, 188,150. Awesome. Now, you made your famous Phil, Phil Helmuth late entrance. What, what were you up to before you came to play? Uh, I mean, you know, I mean, I showed up like Monday, five everybody. hours and 45 <laughs> minutes one? late. And I think that, you know, I got up, I knew they'd put my chips down at 3.30. Mm -hmm. And I got up around 2.30 and I just was so tired I fell back to sleep. So I probably slept 14 or 15 hours. You know, I mean, I just, I don't know, I've been a little bit tired. I've been playing on the internet at Ultimate Bet every day, and I've been winning big every day for 10 days, so at Limit Hole. So I've been a little bit tired, you know, it takes a little energy. Well, it sounds like it was worth it. I mean, you built your chip stack. Was there any big hands? I, I read about a hand that you uh, took David Williams out. I, uh, I played a big pot with the 5-9 of spades. It was a huge bluff that I made, and I talked about that earlier, where I just went crazy. I called and came 10 7 4 clubs. I called six, 7,000 just to bluff on 4th Street. The fourth club claim, he bet 12,000. I moved in with And then he folded, and I showed the hand everybody. Go, whoa! They were all screaming and yelling. And then uh, I won a huge pot where I'd pocket queens. I slow played them. And it came king, queen. And then I uh, yeah, I did bust David Williams. I had sevens. It came queen, five, seven. But I beat Yoshi Nakano for a big side pot. And then I busted Theo Tran at the end. He raised with aces. I re-raised with the five, six of hearts. He made it 2,000. I made it 6,000. Came deuce, four, eight. He checked about 10,000. He raised 15,000. I called with three king. And he, he bet 25,000. I raised 30, 35,000. Put them all in, and he insta-called with aces. And pretty unlucky for him, really. Did he see your bluff? earlier? Maybe that's why he called I came over the top of Theo five, six, seven times, queen, nine, seven, four, gotcha. ace, jack. I mean, I just came over the top of him a lot. I came over the top of everybody a lot. I mean, right now, if I feel somebody's weak, I'm going to play at them. That's all. And it served me well. Well, I saw you playing Chinese poker on break. How did that end up? I didn't play at break. Uh, you know, Doyle and... Doyle and Eli both beat me for like 140,000 or something the last two times we played, oh, okay. and then quickly. So I'm not sure I want to mess with those guys right now. Oh, okay, were they playing on break? Eli? They were playing on oh, break. Okay, yeah, yeah. You're just a spectator this time. Yeah. Gotcha. All right. Well, thank you. Good luck. Thanks for tuning in to our coverage of the Five Diamond World Poker Classic. We'll be back tomorrow for Day One B. I'm Christiana for Card Player TV.